A Big Island woman who died in a murder-suicide worked with children and loved the beach. She's been remembered tonight by family while police investigate a shooting they say involved a police officer. Bridget Namata joins us now with more on this tragedy. Bridget. Yeah, Marissa, the police union tells me the officer served 11 years with the Hawaii Police Department. The daughter of the woman who died said she was married to the officer for nearly a decade. Big Island police spent Sunday afternoon at the scene of a tragedy involving one of their own. Investigators say officers found the bodies of a man and a woman at a Pacific Paradise Gardens home in Mountain View. Police Union President Malcolm Lutu calls this news he never wants to hear. Anytime you know it deals with one of your membership and one of another fellow officer, it's very disheartening, and we're waiting to see um, the outcome of the investigation from the Big Island CID. Um, pr preliminary, we've heard that there's children, and you know our hearts go out to the family uh, for the surviving children, and you know we're just waiting like everybody else to find out what's the outcome of the investigation. Though investigators have not released the victim's names, family members say the woman was 54-year-old Jolene Kapua Allison, who worked for the school bus system. In a statement, Kapua Allison's daughter says, we want everyone to know what a beautiful and wonderful person my mom was and the aloha spirit she bestowed upon everyone she came in contact with. Lutu says while he doesn't know the details of what happened, he is urging police officers across the state to seek help if needed. I don't know what went on in the Big Island, but we do have our own personal problems too that, you know, that every family experiences. Just because they're officers doesn't mean that they don't go through everyday life and everyday problems like, the, like regular people. So, you know, it's, we'll, we'll find out soon enough if, you know, this officer may have needed some help. An autopsy will be done this week to figure out the exact cause of deaths. Marissa.